Hello guys, welcome to Coding Byte. In this video, we are going to talk about the new Rocky Linux. If you are a fan of Linux just like me and want to know more about Linux, then leaving a like, subscribing, or turning notifications on so that you don't miss an upload is really appreciated. Anyway, let's get started. Rocky Linux is a new Linux distro that was born to fill the void that the passing of CentOS has created. It was also the first CentOS replacement announced following the news from Red Hat. Like Almelinex, which is also a CentOS replacement, if you want to check out Almelinex then go to the link given in the description below. Rocky also comes with a strong CentOS pedigree. The project is being led by Gregory Kurtzer, who was the founder and project lead at CentOS from 2002 to 2005. Kurtzer said the project has already raised approximately $2 million in funding, with several large companies, including Amazon, signed up as top-tier sponsors. The first release candidate of Rocky Linux 8.3 is out the project's inaugural release is a new binary compatible alternative to Red Hat Enterprise Linux. Since founding the project at the end of last year, the Rocky Enterprise Software Foundation has been working to put out a release between March and May. Now with May christened, Rocky Linux 8.3 RC1 has been published. Amazon Web Services, GitLab, Monter Vista, and CIQ are among the notable names backing the Rocky Linux effort. Downloads and more details on the 8.3 RC1 inaugural release can be found via the Rocky Linux ORG site. If you are looking for an alternative to CentOS so please check out the Rocky Linux. It comes with GNOME desktop environment, and it is Rocky Linux's first release candidate so don't expect that it will be bugs free. The first stable release is expected to arrive sometime in June to July timeframe. So go check out the Rocky Linux and let me know what are your thoughts on Rocky Linux. Thanks for watching the video and please subscribe to our channel to help us reach the 1000 subs goal and feel free to use the comment box to suggest us more topics to work on. See you next time.